Hi guys, it's Mary Ellen. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an after the pen. So if you want to see me write in my big happy planner, stay tuned. everybody it's me I am here to do an after the pen plan with me yes I know it's been a little while I was supposed to do one last week and somehow it just did not happen so I thought I would treat you to one this week and I kind of thought maybe I wouldn't do it this week because this is not my favorite spread but why not I mean let's just go for it so it's Sunday night I'm just sitting down to plan my week and I've got a couple things going on this week. It's not a super busy week, but the first thing I want to do is put um, National Sticker Day here because tomorrow, Monday, is National Sticker Day. And you know, us planners, we love National Sticker Day, right? How could we not? So I think I was going to pencil this in here first, but... I'm gonna wing it and I might regret this, but let me just try to do this without penciling it in. Kind of messed that up there. I don't know what happened, <laughs> but I'm gonna go in and just color in the downstrokes here. Actually, I'm gonna do it with this pen. All right, and I'm gonna find some stickers probably to put down here because sticker day, stickers, it makes sense to me. So plus there's like that area down there that needs something. So I'll do that. And um, why don't I just put a little emphasis on this. Okay. So that's the first thing. And the most important for my week, right? <laughs> All right, maybe not. Okay, I need to write down some bills that I'm going to be paying tomorrow. And I'm going to do this with a Pentel Energel 0.5. Now I was using the 0.7 which I typically do for bigger letters. Um, I use the 0.5 for the smaller ones. Sometimes I will even use the 0.3, but for some reason the ones I got aren't working super well, so I'm sticking to the five for this right now. And I'm just going to write down my credit card bills that I have to pay because my, all my other ones are on auto pay. A lot of times when I pay my bills, I do not have anything to pay, uh, like there's a zero balance, but I always check them because they're not on auto pay. And the reason I don't put my credit card bills on auto pay is I am forcing myself to go on and check um, the items on my credit cards just in case there's any kind of um, criminal activity, you know, which there has been in the past and I don't want to get stuck and it also forces me to look at what I'm spending. So I do pay my credit cards off every single month and I have not had an, any debt, any credit card debt for a long time. Um, and I like it that way. I am debt free except for my mortgage and that's one of my mortgages. Um, and it's really freaking awesome, I will say. I am loving that. So for now that's going great but sometimes I forget to pay them or I pay them late. And so, yeah, I struggle with that a little bit. What is this up here? Do you see that? That's like a, that's weird. It's like a gray mark. It's like, I did not do that. I think it was in the planner, which is strange. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Okay. So now I'm just gonna write down a couple of things that I have to do during the week and I'm gonna put them on these little tags in the middle. Okay, I don't really have a lot going on this week. My parents are leaving for St. John, and the reason I wrote that down is I have to do my mom a favor while she's gone, and I wanted to remember that. Um, doctor appointment, Tuesday. Cleaners come Wednesday. And the rest of the week is pretty free at this point, but I definitely will be getting 
um, some, you know, things going on during the week that I'm going to fill that out. I need to put my gym schedule in here as well, but I'm going to hang on right now with that. So also weekly meal plan. I don't usually do this, but I think I told you in one of my latest videos that I really want to actually this setup video was I really wanted to try to start eating better and I need to force myself to meal plan if I want to do that. And I just wrote a little note to myself to eat better because like I said, it's been a little lax since Christmas. Not really gaining weight, but I just don't, you know, I want to feel better. I, I could stand to lose a few pounds, so yeah. Um, and I left Sunday open because I don't know yet. And I know I said we were going to do crock pot on Wednesday and I screwed that up here, but that's okay. I'll remember. We'll do tacos on, maybe we'll do tacos on Friday because Thursday we'll still have the crock pot. I don't know. That's just like a general idea. Okay. So the next thing I'm going to do is fill out some to-do lists and I have two lists of things I need to do this week and so I'm just going to fill those out now. Okay, so I filled out some of the to-dos. I'm leaving a few because, I, oh, you know what? I, I have to make phone calls. Phone calls, you guys. Why do they always trip me up? Why am I hesitating to make phone calls? There are still doctors that I have to call and other appointments like that. I just haven't done it. Why? Why don't I do it? I know some of you guys say you have the same problem. It's like a mental block. I don't understand it. All right. So over here... With these little discs I'm gonna just kind of draw circles around them I don't know why but I think it would be cute whoa all right maybe that was a bad idea oh no look at what I did there look at what I did you guys I wrote because I, I can't see the outline of the sticker and I wrote on it so maybe this circle thing is not such a great idea but I can just forget about that. Oh no. Well, sorry I did that, but maybe I can kind of like camouflage it somehow. I don't know. Or maybe I'll take it off and like white it out and put another one there. I, I don't think I need to do that though. Let's just leave it alone for now, shall we? Let's bring in some stickers for National Sticker Day. How about Planner Bay? Because that's what these stickers are. So it'll all match better if I just stick to this sticker book. You know what I'll do? I'll just add one of these little strips. I think I put one over here. No, that was a star one, but I'm gonna put a disc one here. I know that stickers aren't discs, but, or discs aren't stickers, but like, I think that'll be cute there. All right, so I think that's enough for today, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Happy Monday, everybody. It is a dreary day here in Pennsylvania. We've had a lot of dreary days lately, but it's not too cold, so that's a good thing, right? Always a good thing if it's not too cold, because I hate winter. Okay, so looking at my planner again, and it's Monday afternoon. I am just going to fill out a couple of little things in my planner. So I decided I want to make cracked chicken. And I did a recipe plan with me video for that a little while ago. So if you haven't seen that, check that out. It's, I have still haven't made it. I put it in my planner, I haven't made it, but my friend said it's really good. So that's why I put it in there. I'm just gonna take this and kind of do like little dots. I, I don't know why, not dots, dashes. I don't really know why, just to make it a little interesting here. And now I'm going to take a couple of boxes and I'm going to put my gym schedule 
on the boxes. So here's one for tomorrow and one for Thursday. I know that's not centered. I don't really care. And one for Saturday. I skipped the gym on Saturday, you guys. Bad idea. But I'm going to try not to skip it this Saturday. Okay, so I'm going to write in the gym. Okay, and tomorrow I'm going to the gym at 3 o'clock. I don't know the other days yet, but I will fill those in when I do it. I, I have to make appointments. That's why I write this down on my calendar so that I know when I'm going. Okay, so tomorrow, I mean not tomorrow, Wednesday, I have to make sure that I remember to take put the Christmas tree out for the trash people to pick up because it's like the day that they pick up the trees. Um, so I'm just going to write that in right here. It's actually being picked up Thursday morning, but I have to put it out on Wednesday night. Okay, so I have work, I have the gym, that's all done. So today is Tuesday, I just got home from the gym, and I just thought I'd sit down and do some of this with you guys. So Thursday, I'm going to be going like clothes shopping, because like I said, I need some new stuff. I don't know why, I just feel like I do. It's kind of like everything in my closet I'm hating lately and like my pants aren't fitting right and stuff like that. So I wanna go out and do a little bit of shopping and I'm not a big shopper. Like I don't like to shop, I hardly ever do it. I know that that's not normal for a woman not to like to shop, but I just really, like it depends. I like going out if I'm going out with somebody else and like, you know, having fun shopping, looking around and stuff, but like just going out to actually go clothes shopping and try things on is like a hassle for me and I don't like it. But I do need some new things, so, so I'm just going to write down a few things that I need. Okay, so those are just, that's like a guideline of things I'm going to look for when I'm out, and I'll probably put this in my mini as well. Okay, so... Tomorrow I have to remember to stop at my mom's house and pick up a package for her while she's away. So I'm going to write it in up here. I also have to remember to go to the post office and mail Heather's water bottle like I was supposed to do two days ago. So I'm going to write that in as well. Okay. So those are things I have to get done tomorrow. So here I can kind of like play around. I have some space. Um, oh, on Monday I wanna write that Allie and I started watching Ozark. Um, there's not a lot of space, but I think I'm gonna write it like around here. Because I like like writing about TV shows in my planner and like things that my kids and I do uh, just to look back on it and it's fun to remember stuff like that so that's why I'm writing it. I know my writing is really terrible there but that's okay. I'm not concerned. And so Allie went grocery shopping today. Did I write grocery shopping? Oh I wrote it there. So Allie went for me. So I'm just going to mark that down. Give her a little bit of credit in my planner, right? Okay. And the rest, I think, probably I can just fill up with a like a couple little stickers just because I like things pretty stickered up in my planner. You know I do. And tomorrow, I probably will like leave this blank just in case something happens tomorrow that I need to write in there. And now I'm going to work on, well, stickering this up and also writing down here my gratitude list. So I'm going to write here. I know I wrote, like, I put just live in my best planner life and that was kind of like my 
guideline, like my indicator that this was my gratitude list, but just to make it clear, I'm gonna write, I am grateful for. Okay, I'm gonna write out what I'm grateful for in cursive, just to make it a little bit different than this, and make it more interesting looking. So the first thing I'm grateful for is a new relationship. I have a boyfriend now, so very excited about that. He's a great guy, and um, yeah, so it's making me happy and grateful, so number one thing for this week. So things are looking up for 2020, just saying. I know last week was kind of crappy, but it's kind of going well, so. Okay, next thing I am thankful for is stickers, and I'm only saying this because it's like National Sticker Day over here, so why not? Be thankful for stickers. Third thing, I hit 25,000 subscribers on YouTube this week. What? Are you kidding me? Like, that's crazy. I tried to imagine 25,000 people like in outside in my yard, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, they'd be filling up the entire street down the block. Um, that's insane that there's 25,000 people that like wanted to click that subscribe button. And I'm really, really grateful for each and every one of you because without you guys, I wouldn't be doing this right now and I'd be working full time at a real, my real estate job and I'm so glad that I don't have to do that and I'm so glad that I can share my, um, my content with you guys because it makes me happy and it's something I never thought I'd be doing but I fell into it and I'm so grateful that I can do it and I'm so grateful for all of you who watch me so thank you for that okay the fourth thing I'm thankful for is my patrons on my patreon so I just wanted to mention them because they're the best and if you are not familiar with patreon i do have a video on it you can check out also if you go to patreon.com and search planning with bumble you will see like a video from me on there as well and it just talks about a little bit about what patreon is and what you can expect and basically it is extra content from me and you pledge a certain amount a month you get like perks that you're not going to get anywhere else and I get to connect with you a little bit better. So I'm really having fun with that and I'm grateful for my new patrons and my old patrons and I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna give a shout out to a few of them in a second after I finish my gratitude list. So the fifth thing I am thankful for is my upcoming trip to Austin to see my friend Marielle and to see Heather Kell and a couple other people that are down there. I'm very excited about that because um, I've been looking forward to going there for a while. I've never been to Texas, so we're planning that out now, and I think in the next month or so, I'm gonna be doing that, so that's really exciting. I cannot wait. Okay, so I said I'm gonna do a patron shout out, and I'm gonna do it right now. Shout out to Lisa Bissett, Karen Weischer, Kayla June, Abby White, and Veronica Ramirez for being Bumble Buddies. Thank you so much for joining my Patreon, you guys. I really, really appreciate it. And I know I probably but butchered a few of those names, and I'm sorry if I did. But I don't know how to pronounce some words, some names. So what can I say? I tried. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to go and put a couple stickers up here. Just to fill it up a little bit, um, I just want to make it look a little bit more cute you know I like it cute what can I say do I have I love stickers on here I do I have one there I could always put another one though because let's face it I really love stickers I loved them when I was a kid I love them when I'm an adult but I don't think I want to put it there because it's too close to shine bright why don't I stick it down down here That's a little, it's a little bothersome. I'm changing my mind. I'll probably put it on the other side of the page though. Let's see. And I just messed up that sticker there. Oh well. I'm gonna put it, put it up here. Now I have I love stickers, I love stickers. 
You can't have too many I Love Sticker stickers. That's what I say. Okay, how about like a couple planners? Why not? All right, that's good. And then maybe a couple more discs down here. This one got messed up too. Oh well. Okay, that just fills up that little area there so it's not so blank looking. I like it better that way. I know not everybody does. I'm probably also gonna fill up this here. Let's put a yellow one there. And maybe another one over here, like a pink. Okay, that's good. All right, the rest of the week, I still don't know what's going on here. So I'm gonna leave that alone. And if I don't have plans those days, I can just, you know, put in anything. I can put what I ate, I can put whatever. So it doesn't matter. I'll be able to fill it up with something, maybe like another sticker, quote, whatever. And that's it for today. I'm gonna to leave this alone so that if anything happens tomorrow, I can fill it up and same with the rest of the week. Okay, cool. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey guys, it's Wednesday. Sitting down to my planner. It's about four o'clock and I just got home from work. And um, yeah, there's not much I want to do today in here, but I just wanted to kind of sit down every day with you guys. I actually don't always do it every single day. Sometimes I skip days. But uh, especially if it's not a busy week. If it's a really busy week, I'm sitting down every day to look at it. If it's a not so busy week like this week, I might skip a day and then go in the next day and just see what I didn't do or whatever. So um, I do have to do something else today to pick up a prescription. And I did mail the water bottle. I did not pick up my mom's package yet, but I think I'm going to do that tomorrow morning. So I did make an appointment at the gym for tomorrow at nine o'clock, which is earlier than I usually go, but I really hope that it'll help energize me for the day because when I go to the gym early, everything seems to work out better during the day. You know what I'm saying? Okay, um, still don't know what I'm doing here. I may not be doing anything there. I mean, I probably will get plans, but so for right now, I'm still leaving that blank. And right here, I think, um, sorry, I'm just thinking of the things I have to do today. Uh, I have to make sure I bring the Christmas tree out to the curb and my trash. So right here, there's this empty space and I need to fill it up with stickers because I'm not going to have anything else to put in there for the rest of the day because I just got home and I am going to pick up my prescription, but then I'm staying home tonight and Allie and I are watching more Ozark and probably gonna have some wine and chillax and yeah just a nice quiet evening which is always <clears throat> excuse me it's always nice i'm gonna go back in the planner babe book and just check out um see what else i can fill up that area with might go into miss maker let's look there's a whole lot of functional stickers in here and not as many other kinds of stickers why don't i take a little strip and put it across the area underneath the to-dos so that I can like separate the to-dos from like any other sticker that I'm going to decorate down there. I do that I do that a lot with either stickers or washi tape or like little dashes or something. I don't know. I kind of like that look. I don't do it all the time, but just depends on my mood. All right, where is my, uh, there it is, my Exacto. The cleaners came and they sometimes like put things around in various places so that I can't find them. But the good news is I came home to a clean house, always puts me in a good mood. So there's that. Okay, so that looks cute. It kind of ties in what's going on here and here. 
You know what I mean? Balance is everything, people. Balance is everything. So now, what do I put here? I think I need to go into Miss Maker. And because there's more like actual bigger stickers and decorative stickers in here than there are in the other book. So it's kind of like a planner themed spread. It might not be all sticker themed, so we can find other stuff in here that's not stickers, maybe. I could put, I love my planner there. Oh, that's kind of dumb. All right. I kind of wish I picked a really busy week to plan with you guys for the after the pen. I should try to do that, but like I plan it in the beginning of the month so I don't and also like this isn't my favorite spread and I kind of wish I had done it on a another day when it was more of a favorite spread and I had more going on that week like this week's pretty easy so I don't have much going on but that's okay because not every week is busy for me some weeks are really busy it just depends how about this let's do this this little card hello friend that's kind of cute and then something next to it How about an envelope okay that's good enough for that day and then tomorrow I'll come back and do some more with you guys. But let me check off some of the things I have done already. Went to the post office, I straightened for the cleaners, I did some laundry, still need to do more. Gotta start working on Patreon. Happy Mail, I have gotten some of it, um, not boxed up, in envelopes, but I have not gotten all of it done and I need to work on that. Q&A video I did. Need to think about this. Pay bills I did. Need to get bills to my brother because he rents my house out and I send him bills every month. Need to pick up mom's package. Need to give Bumble a bath because she's like a little crusty on her tail. I think she got, she had dog ice cream and some of it got on her. So it's kind of gross. Um, phone calls I made a couple. I need to make more. Okay, I didn't do any of these. Find my license. So I lost my driver's license. What the heck? How do you lose your driver's license? Like, so... I have to go through my purse and just dump out the whole entire thing. I don't know about you, but my purse is full of crap. Need to get it dumped out, see what I did. Maybe it's in a jacket pocket. I have no idea. If I don't find it tonight, then... So I need to do that tonight. Because if I don't find it tonight, then tomorrow I need to go to the DMV and get a new license. Because I can't really be without a license for too long. I think that's probably a bad idea. So... All right, you guys, I will see you on Thursday, which is tomorrow. I'll talk to you then. Bye. You guys, it's still Wednesday. I had to come back here and tell you, first of all, I found my driver's license. I emptied out my entire purse, right? Not my purse. I emptied out my whole wallet, all my cards, everything. I had checked in it like 10 times. I don't know. It showed up miraculously, but even better was I found a $350 Visa gift card in my wallet that I did not know was there. <laughs> what? Um, I've had it for like two years. I remember getting it, but I completely forgot that I had it. And now I've got $350 that's extra found money. That just made my whole freaking day. So go check your wallets and your purses and your drawers for old gift cards because you never know what might be hiding. I mean, probably not $350, but you might find like 20 or 50 or something like that. Anyway, just thought I'd pop on and tell you that and I'll see you tomorrow. Hey guys. So today it's Thursday and I have been working all day. So I did not go shopping, but I think I'm probably going to go tomorrow. So all I really did today was film so and edit and stuff. So I think I'll just write that in here. Where is my paper mate flare? Let me see. I should gather all my supplies before I start the freaking video. All right, here it is. <laughs> False.
it's alarm. All right, I'm just gonna write film videos because that's really all I did today. And I don't have anything else to put in there, so I'm just gonna write that in right there. Okay, now I'm just gonna take some of these stickers from Miss Maker and from, you know, Planner Babe and just stick it up there at the top just to fill in the gaps like I've been doing. And no, I'm not gonna do that one. So not a lot going on this week. It's a pretty um, quiet week, which is not a bad thing. Not really. Um, oh wait, no, 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 never mind. Okay. So maybe a couple of these. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know How about planner sesh. I did have a planner sesh, which is pretty much every day. I have planner seshes every day and this is stuck to the paper. Come on. There we go. Add that and then maybe like something little next to it. How about a little circle here that says create your own sunshine. Something about these books. They're sticking. It's sticking. Oh my goodness. Is it me or the books? I don't know. I'll just do a little sticker there. Okay, that just fills up that area. And then I'm gonna take a couple of discs again and put them right there if I can find them. Just to fill, whoops, just to fill up like just that little white area there. I don't have to do that. I just do because I like it, but it certainly doesn't have to happen that way. All right, that's good enough for today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, it is Saturday afternoon. So I'm just gonna sit down and finish all of this. I usually finish it on Saturdays so I can take a picture for Instagram and also so I can, um, if I have an after the pen video coming out, so I can put this out today. It's a little bit late. I usually get my videos out around noon and it didn't happen today, so oh well. Um, so here, I am going to write snow, it's snowing out there. Um, yeah, it is a wintry mix right now. A little snow, a little bit of freezing rain maybe. Not ideal, but that's okay. I got to the gym this morning, finished that up. And right here, I'm just going to draw some snowflakes instead of putting in those things, those discs. I think I need a different pen though. I need like my blue, the ones that I was supposed to buy, you know, because somehow they all disappeared. My 0.5 Pentel Energel. And yeah, it's gone. So maybe I'll use this. It's like a, a very skinny, skinny pen. It's a 0.3. Maybe too skinny, I don't know. But I'm gonna do a couple of these little snowflakes. Just do some dots around it for fun. That's a weird one. Oh well. One more little one up here. All right. So that's something you can do when it snows. Just doodle a few little. I'm gonna do one down here so it doesn't look so like balanced. Just doodle, doodle of little, like snowflake. I don't know why I just did a black circle in the middle of that one. That's kind of ugly. But you know, does not matter. 
Okay, so tomorrow night I'm going to my guy's house for the first time. So yeah, I'm gonna write that in here. And it's three day weekend and hopefully you guys have a three day weekend. I don't because you know, I'm a workaholic. <laughs> so there's that. And I don't know, we'll, we'll see what happens. Okay, so I'm just gonna fill up this area because I don't think I'm really gonna have too much to put in here. Maybe I should leave it alone though, just in case I need space up here. Uh, I'm gonna fill in some of it at least. How about we'll work for planner supplies? I do work for planner supplies. All of us do, I guess. Yeah, I'm just putting this down. I'll leave like a tiny bit of room here and maybe here to write in if I need it. But I don't think, I don't think I'm gonna need it. Might as well just fill it up now so I can take my picture and be done with it. There's also room to here to write if I need it. So, oh, I, I did want to write this. I filmed a lot of doodles today. Like I filmed, I must have filmed like at least 20 doodles of the day. So I'm going to write that in because, hey, why not give myself credit? Just writing that in in cursive for a change. All right, so I did that. Um, let me just fill up this area up here and we will be done. Thanks for joining me for this. Um, I'm going to put a few of these in. Thanks for joining me for this um, after the pen video. I know these are long, but hopefully you don't mind that and you like them because I like doing them. I think they're fun and they're a lot of work for me, but they're fun too. So I don't mind. Okay, that's it. Anyway, hope you guys have a great one. Stay tuned for Doodle of the Day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.